All right, so today what we're going to do is we're going to use the split strategy with larger numbers. So we're going to look at 374 plus 289. When using the split strategy with larger numbers, the problem with using lines is that it can get kind of complicated. So what we're going to do is we're going to split both numbers based on expanded form. So 300 plus 70 plus 4. 200 plus 80 plus 9. Now instead of using arrows to uh, connect all of these, what we're going to do is just write them underneath to the side. I'll just use some different colors here to help keep the place value positions together. So we're going to have 300 plus 200, and we'll add the tens, 70 plus 80, and then we'll add the 1s, 4 plus 9. Notice I'm careful to make sure that my 100s columns are in, and 10s columns and 1s columns are all lined up together. Now we will add those amounts going across. So 300 plus 200 is 500. 70 plus 80 would be 150. Another way to think of that is 7 tens plus 8 tens is 15 tens, and 4 plus 9 is 13. Again, I'm keeping the hundreds together, the tens together, and the ones together. And then that way, I can simply add right down the line. So 0 plus 0 plus 3 is 3 ones, 0 tens, 5 tens, 1 ten is 6 tens, and 500 and 100 is 600. So I can add, find my final answer by splitting my numbers apart in expanded form, adding hundreds, tens, and ones, and then combining the hundreds with the tens and with the ones. So 374 plus 289 is 663.